Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Asia. I'm a zero based budger out of San Diego, California. Me and my husband are a dink household and we're on a debt free journey. We want to share the journey with all of you guys. So if you're a returning subscriber, whoa, <laughs> my coffee. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for your continued support. I appreciate you. Y'all, when I tell you, I, I don't know what was in my coffee today. I do, but like, I don't know what's different because your girl is a little, a little hyper doing this today when, um, the other day I was really excited, but anyway, today is a savings challenge day. So we're going to get that going. Let me go get the money. We're going to get set up and I'll be right back. Oh, all right. Okay. Relax. So let's get this cash counted. I don't exactly remember how much I have in here, but we got it. Okay, so we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120, 125, 126. Okay, so we have $126 to put into savings challenges today. And I can, what? Bro. Okay. Anyways, I can tell you that a bulk of this money will be going into a specific challenge, but we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. So again, 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 like, I don't know what it is, but you know, you, I go to the bank and they just, they just give me whatever comes out of the machine, man. Like they just, I get it like it does they don't get paid extra to care about the bills that they give us but I would kind of like it if they cared <laughs> okay so let's let's get this let's get this all let's get this all fanned out yeah I promise you I have I have friends in like UK and Australia and I love their accents so much. And they, and they just make fun of how I sound like extreme 1000% California. Okay. So we got that, right? So that's done. If y'all don't already have sort quick, you better get some and change your life. I have this spare dollar. I know that that's not going to... That's not what I budgeted for, but we got it. If you guys care about the coffee I got today, I have a sweater weather chai, which is a just white chocolate with chai and I have white coffee in here and it's from Dutch Bros and I'm, it's probably the white coffee that's making me. <laughs> okay, let's get started, yeah. So we're gonna take this out. It's making my book like, Thick as heck. Okay, we'll get to that in a sec. So, Wanderlust Savings Challenge, we're going to do $10 in here. And I, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna keep using the fives because that's that's what I got going right now. So five, 10, 15, 20 in Wanderlust. So we'll color this in. Y'all, if you haven't seen, whoa, if you haven't seen Balance and Budget and her like collection of Sharpies, y'all are missing out. Like I'm, tr <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to tell my dad, hey, the next time you go to Costco, can you pick up, can you pick up your firstborn, <laughs> a pack of <laughs> variety Sharpies? <laughs> He's really going to be like, you're being dumb. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna put um, we're gonna put five in here. I know that last time I did this, I said I could do any sort of multiple of five, but because I'm kind of being strict on how much I'm putting away and where it's gonna go first, we're just gonna do that. But no lie though, I don't know. I mean, like I'm tight with my dad, so. <laughs> he'd still get me the pack of Sharpies, but he would really be like, Asia, what the hell? Like, do you, what do you need? <laughs> 
Sorry, I'm so I'm so giggly because I'm thinking about it, and I just know that my dad would really be like, "What are you gonna be using 25, 30 different sharpies for? Like, what, <laughs> what in the business do you need this for?" <laughs> All right, no overtime is gonna get another five. So we're looking at five, ten, and fifteen in here. Did I even count that? I don't know. I think we had ten in that one. Yeah, 10. <laughs> okay, so no overtime. This is going to go towards date night. Yeah. Okay, so date night is looking nice. So next, next savings challenge, we are going to have to put 10 in here. So all good. Okay, and then speaking of my dad, speaking of my father, <laughs> we're gonna be uh, doing another $10 in Father's Day. See, and my dad doesn't watch my videos. He doesn't have anything to do with the stuff that I do online because he's not like super old, you know? Like my dad's in his 50s, but he really does not navigate the internet like I thought he would is what it is <laughs> and if you guys were here for my last savings challenge video um i did do a story time as to like why i'm actually trying to put money away um for father's day because last father's day i had like a whole debacle five whoa five ten fifteen twenty whole debacle because you know i know my dad the way i know him so Anyways, don't do joint gifts <laughs> unless you know for a fact that it is something that your family wants or your bestie wants or whatever. Okay, fitness membership. This is definitely going to have to get some sh money. We got 5, 10, 15. 20, 25, 30. So we're looking good on this already. My fitness membership, like I said, it is an online gym. So being able to put this money away, I do pay for it annually. So this is going to be really nifty. Oh, come, come. Come on. All right, perfect. So this one, we'll do that one last. So let's open this one up. So the next one, how much do I have here? I have five, 10, and then that extra dollar. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do the 10. And then I'll actually just put this little stray dollar in with it. So anything extra I got that is obviously unaccounted for, We'll just throw it where we feel like throwing it. So today I'll put it, hello, I'll put it in here. Oh no. Mm. Beautiful. Alrighty. So this one is actually going to be getting all of this. So we're looking at 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. 75 80 so if you guys saw my um if you guys saw my sinking funds video recently um you guys will know i had that whole thing let's see one oh my gosh okay so if you guys watched my sinking funds video you guys will know i had a huge thing with my bank and my credit card. So as of now, we do not have our thousand minimum emergency fund. We literally had to clear it out. So we have nothing left. So I'm actually gonna change this. So instead of the 401k, I'm scared, is it dry? <laughs> okay, so instead of the 401k start, we're actually just gonna do emergency. That's what we're gonna do. And then I will get to the 401k 
later on. But I would rather make sure that we have this in place. And then we also can't do anything extra on our debt until we have our emergency fund back in place. So that's that. Oh, they got it growing already. Yeah, like look, I don't know. I it's this. It's it's definitely the seventy dollar bump. But, um, guys, I want I want you guys to understand. And maybe it's because I've been having a really good time with reminding myself, even if you're not putting away a lot, like. Before this 126 that I put away today, last week I had $55 that I put away or 50, somewhere around there. Um, and it just matters that you're putting something away, period. So like, as you guys can see, my challenges are not, my challenges are not super high in amount. It's $10, $5, I've been putting this away, another five, max is 20 on the note over time, 10 here. 15 is a bit high for some, which I get, but 15 is doable for me, but you can always change this. So I just chose this to be 15 because I can afford it. And that's like what I'm willing to put away to make sure that I meet my annual fee. And then with my emergency, it's only $10 a piece, like $10 per rupee. So I just want to let you guys know that saving and putting money away is possible, even if it's not the amounts that you see in higher income videos. Um, and then you guys can see here, I didn't put a vinyl on this yet, but this is a 250 tracker and the max amount that you're putting in one envelope is $20. That's the highest that this one goes. So it's, it's variable for everybody. And something that I want to touch base on is, um, <clears throat> I've noticed when you're watching other content creators. And if this is not something that interests you, I'm just going to touch base on like what I've been seeing in my recommended on my homepage. So if you guys don't want to stick around, that's totally fine. I understand. I got no more cash left. So the stuffing is done. Um, if you guys enjoyed it and you guys liked hanging out with me for that little bit of time, please be sure you like and subscribe um, and you support me and help me out because your girl's trying to get that um, 500,000 hour, yada, yada. So I appreciate you guys. Um, <laughs> but if you guys are going to hang out with me past this point, I appreciate you too. Um, something that I wanted to really touch base on is that I've been seeing a lot on my recommended homepage saying low income, low income, low income. And everyone's definition of low income is going to be different. So me personally, uh, when I hear low income, I think you're, you're, maybe 150 bucks and under to me that's low income when it comes to putting money away um like cash stuffing and all this stuff because realistically like we're we're playing with our money here like we're putting cash in envelopes to have it for a later date a later usage um instead of just throwing it into the bank right so um but there are people that i've seen I don't know any names specifically, but I just see the amounts and people title their videos low income and they're putting away like 700, 800, $900. And understand that some of that may be money that came from a typical regular job. And then the rest of it could come from, you know, a shop that they run or a side hustle that they have. And I just, I just want to tell you guys that if you guys are doing this, just don't be intimidated. Um, and I say that not just for you, but for myself, you know, if you're starting this journey and you're trying to make sure that you get something in an envelope, don't be discouraged. Don't be intimidated. Everyone's got their own amounts. Everyone's on their own journey. Um, and I just live for the community in the money, the money stuffing, the cash saving community. Everyone is fantastic. So I live for the community, not for the amounts. I live for the support and the encouragement and not for the end product because all of us are just trying to save for longer term goals. Um, and that's, it is what it is. So anyway, thanks for listening to my TED talk. Sorry, <laughs> I'm rambling a lot, but I'm just discovering things every single day about how I can change my mentality. And I just want to share those little, little nuggets with you guys. So I am out of cash. 
So <laughs> the next video will be a wallet, cash wallet stuffing, I believe. I got to double check that, but I think that is my next video. And I will see you guys then. Until then, be kind, be safe, do your best. And yeah, have a good day. Be happy. Remember that money comes easy. I'll see you guys later. Bye.